The Saints wrapped up their second practice as they prepare for the Carolina Panthers on Sunday. Welcome into our Saints practice report, I'm Aaron Summers. The Saints spent all of training camp working in three new starters on the offensive line. Sunday against the Panthers will be their first real test. I'm excited to see our, our five play together. Um, but a lot of hard work in the offseason and uh, now look forward to their reward, which is Sunday. Third year tackle Trevor Penning made the move from left tackle to right tackle. It's taken a little bit of time for Penning to find his footing after suffering an injury leading into his rookie season. Offensive coordinator Clint Kubiak is confident in his ability on the right side. He's a super coachable guy and, uh, you know, he's had some really good practices and he's and a, a lot can be said about where he's where he started and where he's come from. And, uh, you know, I'm really proud to get to coach Trevor and Rick Dennison and John Benton. And those guys have done a phenomenal job with him and, and with the whole offensive line. But, you know, he's he's earned the right to go out there and play really well on Sunday. And I'm looking forward to, you know, going and seeing what he does. But it's it's a five man show up there and it's all five working together. It's not just him. Penning has always been an effective run blocker. His focus this offseason was improving his pass protection, not only using his power, but his hand positioning and figuring out how to use his angles for more leverage. On the opposite side of the line, first round pick Taliese Fuaga has had a seamless transition to the left tackle position after playing his entire collegiate career at right tackle. Fuaga has elite speed and athleticism for his size and he processes the game at a really high level. Fuaga and Penning have spent time together working in extra reps after practice. I think just like, you know, getting little reps here and there after practice, um, what we got to clean up. Um, what we saw during practice or anything like that, you know, Trevor's a, a big help for me. Just, you know, he knows a lot about this offense also. So just being there for him and him being there for me is just, it, it works. Communication across the offensive line has to be solid in order to establish that run game, set up the play action and pass game, especially against newly acquired Panther three-time pro bowler Jadavian Clowney. As for a quick injury report, A.T. Perry, the wide receiver, was out for the Saints on Thursday with a hand injury. For more, you can head to NewOrleansSaints.com. You'll see the complete injury report there, video, interviews, and photos.